ladies and gentlemen, Vera, the psychic lady. What is the significance in Pig Farmer? Simon, I feel so strong. Do you have a pig? No. I have a pig. No, you don't. No, I don't think so. Are you a cop? No, but some people think I am. Some people do. Yes, they certainly do. I see you, you're an artist or a carpenter. You work with your hands. Yeah. What do you do, sweetie? I'm a health inspector. A health inspector? You inspect things? Uh-huh. You do that with your feet? <laughs> Blessings to you. I've got to move on because I'm feeling something strong. This young lady back here, honey, your grandmother is coming through. <laughs> She's coming through to me. <laughs> <laughs> My grandmother's alive. <laughs> yes, I know that. <laughs> I'm very aware of that, and she's coming through to me to tell you she's going to be alive for a long time. <laughs> so quit yeah. worrying about it. Tara, you get so caught up in worrying about your grandmother's dying. She's not even sick, honey. <laughs> I'm really something strong here. Honey, don't be startled. Your spirit guide is here. Now, everybody has a spirit guide, okay? And that's someone that looks over you and guides you, hence the guide part of it. <laughs> and a spirit that's guide right. can take any form. It could be a bird or an Indian or something. <laughs> your spirit guide has taken the form of carrot top. <laughs> I leave you with this message. Lives are like Starbucks. There's always another one around the corner. That's great. Thank you. Bye bye.